I'm here with Pastor Justin Cummings. What's up, bro? Nothing much. Glad to be here. I really enjoyed your sermon. You were talking about the, the weariness of the Christian, uh, and, and that, that hit home for me. And so we were really taking note and taking stock of what you were talking about. But um, as I was talking with you a little bit here in the studio, you were saying that you actually had a little difficulty initially narrowing down on what, what you were going to talk about. Can you tell us about that, that process? <laughs> yeah, no, absolutely, Sean. I, so it's a great question. Um, yeah, in my preparation, I was, I mean, a while back, I was kind of considering what to teach on. And there's really between two things, either, yeah, the weariness in the Christian life, uh, which is obviously what I landed on, or um, uh, I was considering teaching on the incomprehensibility of God, um, which is kind of a big one. Mm. Um, it feels and, like a very different sermon. Yeah, they're like two totally different things. So, um, yeah, so it was kind of back and forth. But um, in my quiet time, I, you know, and how I landed on weariness in the Christian life, um, in my quiet time, I came across Galatians 6, um, verses 7 through 10. And, um, yeah, it just spoke to me, and the Holy Spirit landed that right on my heart. And so I went, went with that and and uh, felt like it was it was uh, needed. So, yeah, mm -hmm. I'm kind of curious about, I mean, it was such a great sermon. That's the one that I think you were supposed to preach, maybe. Um, but like that, that the incom, the in, you got to help me. Incomprehensibility. The yeah. Incomprehensibility. Yeah. That's such an interesting, I almost yes. want like the, what were you, what were you trying to do with that one? Yes. So yeah, no, there's two attributes of God. Um, so there's the incomprehensibility of God and then the knowability of God. So this, reality that we we can know God, right? Mm. God has made himself known, praise right. God. Right. Um, but we we also, at the same time, we can't fully comprehend God. Right. right? With a human mind. It, yeah. Exactly. Yeah. Like we will not exhaustively, I think the, the correct definition is you can't, you cannot exhaustively know God. Mm. Um, I mean, we're going to be with him forever in eternity, right? Like right. we're never going to fully just be like, yep, I got God in a box. Here we go. Got him. Um, mm. So, so what does that mean for us? incomprehensibility of God, understanding that. Um, and so my, where my heart was kind of going with that is understanding that that is, that is something we really got to bite down on. We got to mm -hmm. know in our Christian, uh, in our Christian life, um, in our theology and, um, kind of applying that to, yeah, the different paradoxes that are in scripture, mm -hmm. um, and being willing to rest in that. Right. Um, even, even though I can't know everything about God, and, that's okay. Yes. Yes. And so a lot of people get tied up with like, man, I got to get this into a formula. And, and, mm -hmm. and so it can mm -hmm. cause a lot of things in your heart. So that's kind of where I was planning on going with that. And maybe a future sermon. So yeah, maybe we will hear that sermon in the future. Maybe. Justin, thanks so much for coming. In the studio yeah, absolutely. Today. Thanks to you, brother. Yeah.